Hey guys, and welcome to this video. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create an ebook cover in Canva. If you guys are new to Guide Infinity, if you could give us a like and a subscribe, that would be amazing. Cool, okay, let's jump into it. So as you can see, we are in canva.com and what we're gonna do is come up to the search bar and we're gonna type in ebook cover. As you can see, we've typed it in and there we go. We've got ebook cover down here at the bottom. So we're just going to give that a click. And then as you can see, there is lots of different covers that you could choose from. So we've got 1,484 templates available. Cool, okay. So some of them are only gonna be available on Pro. Um, I do have Pro at the minute. So they will are sort of coming up for me. So let's have a little look and see um, which one that we kind of like the look of that we can take and then edit for us. Um, let's have a look, it's quite pretty. Um, okay, cool. So I'm gonna click on this one here um, and I'm gonna edit that. So given that a click, and then as you can see, you wanna customize this template. So give that a click. Um, amazing. Okay, so I'm going to want to change the background image. So I'm going to come over to Pexels and type in, let's see, so I'm going to do a recipe book. So I've typed in the word cupcake. Now Pexels is amazing for free stock footage and free stock images as well. So you can use them without having to credit the creator um, and they're free to use, which is really, really amazing. Obviously you can um, credit the creator if you want to, it's totally up to you, but what's amazing is you don't have to. So I've typed in cupcake and I'm gonna do photos. And what's good as well is you can also change the orientation of the image that you want. So because our book, um, it's all quite long, I would like a portrait photo um, as opposed to landscape. So if you come to filters and on all orientations, you can press vertical and then that is going to give us vertical images of um, our cupcakes. So I do love this one. I think it looks so absolutely gorgeous. Um, or like a nice chocolate one that looks quite nice, like quite moody. Um, so it's quite hard to choose from because I love them. Oh, that one looks quite nice as well um, with the chocolate chips and things. So I think I'm going to go for I'm going to try this one. Um, amazing. So I'm just going to press, uh, so free download. So that's great. That's gone into my downloads file. Okay. And then what we're going to do is come back over to Canva and then on the left hand side here, if you click uploads and then upload files, it will take you straight to your downloads. And there you can see our lovely image of our cupcake is there. So what we're going to do is bring that over when it's loaded. We just got to wait for that bar and that's great. And then we're just going to bring that over and amazing that has changed that for us. Um, I'm going to delete this at the bottom. I'm going to bring this down because I think you want to see the cupcake as well. Um, so we can pop that there and then the text. So I'm going to say, um, what is this going to be called? Okay. Um, the, the five best cupcake recipes. Um, amazing. Okay. So we've got the five best cupcake recipes ever. So what we can now do is we can edit this for, um, for us and how we want. So let's say we don't like the text. So what we can do is highlight this. We can come up to the top toolbar and then we can go through and click the, um, the, the text that we like. So let's see. Okay, so I'm going to do that for the minute and then I'm going to delete that. Okay, cool. So let's make this. Okay, and then what we're going to do is I'm just going to bring this down and then I'm going to widen it across and then just make it a little narrower. Okay, amazing. Let's get that sort of center. Okay, and then let's fade this. So I just want it to sort of fade. Okay, cool. Okay, so we've got our 
we've got the basis of our ebook cover. So I'm just going to change the font and make it a little bit more interesting and a little bit more fun. So I'm going to try this. So I think that's that's quite nice. Um, I want it to be just make it a little bit bigger. Amazing. Yeah, that's cool. So yeah, I just wanted it to be a little bit more fun. Um, we can also then make this rectangle box a little bit um sort of smaller if we wanted to and then i actually think i preferred it a little bit bigger let's just undo that cool okay we can then change the color of the font if we want to so if we click on the text and then we come up to the a with the color underneath we can change it um, and have something sort of stand out go yellow orange red sometimes love a bit of color, sometimes not. So I quite like the brown. I think that goes quite cool. So what I then want to do is I just want to make this box stand out a little bit more. So I'm just going to add a line to kind of frame the box. So if you come over to elements on the left hand side in the search bar, if you type in line and then select the line that you want and then give it a click, and then as you can see it appears there so if you then want to drag it down to the top of the box and then adjust the length of it to make sure that it fits and then change the color that you would like and then you can copy and paste it to do it um, on the bottom line as well and as you can see that just kind of makes the um, the title pop a little bit more and just brings that attention to it as well so I just think that's really good but obviously again you can do whatever you want to um, and then you can add any other elements that you like um, just sort of give it a search and see what comes up but I kind of like it I think it's quite simple the chocolate cupcake looks delicious um, and then what you want to do when you are then ready with your ebook cover if you come up to the top right and press on share and then you can press download and then it will suggest that you do it as a png i do too if you can because the quality is that little bit more better and then you can hit the download button when you are ready and that's it guys that is how to create an ebook cover on canva i really hope that you guys found this video useful if you could give us a like and a subscribe it would be amazing we do appreciate it so so much thank you for watching and i will catch you guys in the next one